good morning vlog. Uh, it is the last day of Summer in Sydney, day three, and uh, my voice is like really sore right now, or raspy. So that's not particularly great. So let's try figure out, and I'm heading in. Part today, this Twix is my lunch. All I've had. All right, I made it to the XL Center. <coughs> I've had some and drink, and my throat is a little bit better sounding. I took the DLR to get here from where we're staying, and ended up like uh, only one stop too far because I wasn't paying attention. So I had to come back to myself. And then when I got here, I wanted to have food, but unfortunately, like there was hardly anything left. It is that I liked, but I eventually got something. So what I did get to eat though was like probably the world's soggiest chicken salad sandwich I've ever had. So that was. That was not too good, but um, yeah, I'm heading to a couple. Of, I'm heading to a panel now, and it should be last day of the convention, so it should be pretty good. Don't, don't stir away from what you love because if, you, if it's not you, it's not you. So I think now I'm just going to continue uh, improving my skills as a filmmaker and figuring out exactly what it is that that can translate into. And John, I think it's mad as well. The doors that YouTube opens for you. So I believe that I always had the skills to be a very good television presenter. Always. But I was only given the chance because I have this channel with a certain number of followers. It's an awful thing, isn't it? But it's the way life is. So I think I, I would be a silly person um, to throw away the platform that gave me the opportunity that I always wanted just because I, I got that opportunity. How about we just go for it, keep it growing and see what other amazing things come from us. I don't this is where I got this like all Twix and caramel and stuff in it. Mm. Well, I am just sitting here, chilling on this bean bag. It's quite, it's quite pink. I don't know if you can hear me because it's quite loud. There's an open mic just like behind me there. And uh, yeah, it's, um, it's going good this afternoon. Well, that is Summer in the City finished. Uh, the main event is completed. Uh, <clears throat> I'm heading into London to meet up with a friend for dinner uh, in central London. It's so that pretty fun. Um, but I'm also then going to be heading back here to meet up with all the guys from Summer City um, who have been staying with and other YouTubers just to have one last party uh, this evening. So we need to be out at like 10 a.m. tomorrow. I have our rooms, but um, <coughs> yeah, we let's make one late, so hopefully not as late as I did last night. <laughs> Here we are, pretty cool, pretty cool. You know, I need to find some that, you know, I think this is my first time. <laughs> so it's slightly later, and <laughs> if you lean over, you're gonna be on camera, oh, but you, okay. yeah, so. Uh, I'm here with a friend who like doesn't want to be on camera. It's, it's, it's okay. Hi. Uh, yeah. So um, yeah. So we're hanging out and we got this. We got ice cream. So this is like the most amazing place ever because this ice cream actually looks like the shape of a flower, which is really cool. So the way they do that, um, I don't know how they do it, but I'm gonna eat it before it melts. That's a pretty cool car right there. So yeah, Jess is filming me, filming me. <laughs> so um, yeah, we're here at the, we've come to a particular place in London, where, called the Harry Potter and the Cursed Child, and apparently, um, this is like, well, so this would be like an adaptation of the book, yeah. And according to Jessica, you have to like, book for tickets like a year in advance, and it's played over the, like two days. So you have to come back, like twice to see it but I did clarify you don't come back one year then the next year you just you get your two day tickets you can come back on the same day though do the morning and then the afternoon really? or the evening that's yeah. cool what on earth did I come back to? I guess this is like after party for summer in the city house house no vital no vital no vital no vital no vital what about 100, 200 YouTubers are gonna crash Novatel, uh, whatever it is? Uh, the place where the bar, that's it, the bar. Uh. <laughs> <coughs>
All right. Slightly later, I'm sitting here in the Novotel bar. I hired company. I don't know where a company went. Uh, so yeah, um, that's good. Uh, there's some people here still. It's like half midnight, 1 a.m. 1 a.m. 1 a.m. And uh, yeah, there's some people here still, and we're just chilling. Sunday night, since he's over. That's sad, but oh well, whatever. Um, yeah, that's about it. You come over here, you're fucking bastard. Come over and tell me where it is. Come on, Sparky. Come on. I did not give consent for this video. Jump the tracks. Blur my face on YouTube, I'll have it fucking struck. Well, jump the tracks, I dare you. Blur my face or die. Ah, see you later. I find a dispute. I will find a dispute. See you later. <laughs> I did fucking thing. Bye. They're going one way into London, and uh, me and him are going the other way. Bye. Uh, I, <laughs> I, I didn't end the vlog, so this is going to go on this one, because this day is going to be a, just a short day of vlogging. But next day, and we are heading home. Well, he's not. He decided to stay in London a few more days, but um, yeah, so I'm heading home. And they, those guys are heading home. And here's a train coming. There's a lot of things now, like the Royal Alpha. Cool. Wait for it. That was literally the bumpiest train I've ever been on. So um, I did go to London to the airport. I wanted to see if I had earlier flights, because my flight's not until like 20 past 6 at night. And I really wanted to go home, but I don't have any earlier ones I can get. Uh, the only one I could even get if I'd wanted to book another ticket was like British Airways. If you get out of Heathrow Business Class at like 3pm, and that's not not really one. If you don't really want any 300 pounds to go home a few hours earlier. So I'm going into London just to... I really want to go to the Costa for some reason. <laughs> Trafalgar Square. So yeah, I decided I was coming to the Costa and the uh, water stones of Trafalgar Square. I got a piece of carrot cake and a hot chocolate and this nice view over here. Yeah. I found the surface week. <coughs> I want one of these. Alright, I am uh, just been chilling in the airport the past few hours and my flight will be up soon, the gate is not showing yet. But I'm gonna get some cough drops because I've been coughing a little bit and my throat's a bit dry. Well, thank you guys for watching the vlog. If you liked it, hit the like button down below. If you didn't like it, hit the like button anyway. And if you'd like to leave a comment, I would very much appreciate that. And you can share the video with your friends and family. I would also appreciate that. And if you would like to follow me or subscribe to me on YouTube, Vidme, and of course on Facebook, I would also appreciate that. And I will see you guys in the next vlog. That was the last, uh, as you probably thought, it was the last London Summer in the City vlog. Uh, but I'll have some, hopefully, some exciting stuff coming up over the next couple of months. So we'll see you guys in the next vlog, whenever, whenever that is. Anyway, adios.